Hello everybody, so today I will talk about the calculus. The topic today is about mathematical induction. So I use one example to illustrate in mathematic induction. First, we need to say that the basis in here is about n equal to 4 because 4 is the, the lowest number in here and n should be the integer that's why we need to choose the lowest integer in this one that's if number 4 and we put number 4 in here 4 factorial greater than 2 power n and we need to have the number is about 24 is greater than 2 power 4 and 2 power 4 is about 16 so that's it true now we have the next one induction assume that n equal to k so we have k factorial greater than 2 power k and uh, show true when n equal to k plus 1 so we just put the formula in here and we got about k k plus 1 factorial greater than 2 power k plus 1 in the k plus 1 factorial we put about k factorial and k plus 1 and we have 2 power k multiply 2 in here we know k factor is greater than 2 power k and uh, k plus 1 is greater than 2 or k greater than minus 1 because we have n greater than 4 so k is about the positive number so k plus 1 is greater than number 2 so this one is true too why? because we have this one is, is from here and k plus 1 is greater than number 2 so 2 can multiply together is greater than 2 can multiply together so that we show that is true so the next one this is another example for this one I just show in here and this one too so we put the n equal to 1 so we put the number 1 in here and you show that's the a and a assume that we have n equal to k so we put the k in here and we put the k in this one to show to n equal to k plus 1 so we put the k plus 1 and we put about the series behind in here so we have this series in here we re replace the 2k power 2 multiply k plus 1 power 2 in this one that's why in in from here so now we have the equation we just expand the left and the right and at the end we can see that the left equal to the right so it means that's true so this is one example about in mathematic induction here is another example we put a n equal to 13 because 13 is the lowest positive integer in here so we put in here and we found it's true in the both side then we have n equal to k and n equal to k plus 1 
at the end we have to multiply 2k in here 2k is richer than 500k we just put in here and 2k is richer than 500 because at the k equal to 13 we got about 8192 is richer than 500 so this one is true that's it the end thank you for watching